Hello everyone, what's up, man? We're going to Villain Saga episode 4! Whoa! I just can't believe after 3 weeks since episode 1, 2, and 3 aired simultaneously in one day. Oh my god, it took all the reactions for surprise that episode 1 and 2 and 3 is out. So we had to do like a 1 hour and a half long I don't know, reaction and stuff like that. Although some of us broke into 1 and 2 and 3 episodes each. But let's just say, you know, for me, I did episode 1 separately from episode 2 and 3. So yeah, it wasn't fun at all doing a 1 hour long reaction because like, you know how to make a video and stuff like that and it takes a while to make a video so that was like three weeks ago and i, I can't really take a long break also it's, it's almost, almost like a reminiscence of you know attack, attack of titan season three part two that released this late so yeah episode four is finally out guys or oh, is out today i just can't wait to watch the you know the, this strategy gonna happen to thor and you're gonna trigger thor finn to become you know this very depressed angered person which you saw in the opening uh, yes i've been told by this of course so Wow, I just can't wait for today's episode because let's just see how would Thor die from this, you know, um, you know, well, this, you know, cowardly attack by, you know, Floki, that guy being, you know, asked by this uh, Thor's former colleague to ask him, ask him to kill of Thor for betraying them, like, you know, he ran away from the battle due to have a, like, a peaceful family life. And yes, you know, the episode one started out with, you know, Thor being trying to explore the world, know about, you know, this very paradise land of, um, I think it was called Vinland, which, you know, the title pretty much says it all. And so, you know, it, it, they're having such a peaceful life until this slave came by, which sets off a series of events leading up to that, you know, his former colleague came over to him and asked him to rejoin the battle uh, or else they take hostages of the village and of course Thor to protect his village he had to like go into battle although the whole village is like you know very excited for it they want to join the battle Thor trying to like, save them by you know putting them uh, putting them aside in the, this area although it's now been set as a trap and which you know Floki came in to like try and kill off Thor from the order of him but let's, let's just see how Thor goes about to fight off those pirates or whatever they are and but of course we can pretty much see it he's not going to survive this and he's pretty much going to set uh, sort of so like trigger Thorfinn to like have this revenge and, and sort of like joins him maybe from Floki I'm not sure we'll really see but yeah I just can't wait to check out today's episode and pretty much going to be the, the tragedy of the season well hopefully it is so yeah just can't wait for today's episode and we I wait three weeks for it guys three fucking weeks for it so let's get started shall we okay Richard, let's get started shall we oh my god oh yeah by the way when I say Floki I mean Aslad my bad, switch it around. I'm terrible with names. That, the guy that asked to kill Thor is Aslan. My bad. So, yeah, let's get started, shall we? So, here we go in 3, 2, 1, go. Oh, let's see how this episode pans out. I have a bad feeling about it. There's going to be a strategy, which I've been told about. Oh, ho, ho. a one man army. Oh, ho, ho. <laughs> man, this is a one-man army, man. <laughs> oh, ooh, ooh. My God, he knows Tai Chi, man. <laughs> ooh, man, he knows Tai Chi, man. <laughs> I mean, at least he's not killing people, but he's injuring them badly. <laughs> what, how, what, what's wrong with him? Oh, he went berserk mode. <gasps> oh. Oh, oh my god, attacking his own men to get because they're getting his way. Oh my god, berserk mode. No, this is not looking good. Dude, what's he doing? Abandon ship! Abandon ship! Did he eat something or what? Oh, okay, he eats some berserk mushroom. <laughs> oh, 
Okay, now they're face to face. <sighs> oh, of course, it doesn't face him at all. <laughs> and he also injured his eyes. Oh. Knockout! Just like that. Just like that. <laughs> yeah, he's a troll, right? Okay, one more to go. Oh, he's alive. Oh, wow. Guess when you're in berserk mode. You can fight as long as you want. Oh dear, they're in trouble. He's gonna be the first one to die, by the way. Try to be act all tough and stuff, but he's gonna be the first one to die if he charges in first. And you're gonna sell them off if they capture them. Oh dear. Oh, they're fucked. They are fucked. Oh, what? Oh, he threw him. <sighs> Yo. Wow. <sighs> oh, my God, single handedly. Defeated two warships. Oh, so we do have an opening. I thought it's gonna skip the opening. Okay, so we do have an opening. You know, I just can't wait to download the full song for this opening because this opening is legit, man. And obviously we can see that Thor is overpowered, but he didn't kill them because if he kills them, then he's living his old ways again. He's having a new way to like injure them badly so they cannot fight and oh, and that's to re like sort of retreat. But I have a feeling something, something scheme is going to happen, by from the especially by Aslat, so let's see. Oh my god. See? Thorfinn, something happened to Thorfinn which make him like that. So maybe in this episode today we will get the answers. Obviously I had to do something about it, maybe Thor his father dying. Again, not a big fan of how they end the opening. <laughs> Threatening them already. Oh yeah, how could I forgot there's archers on the cliff. Yeah. Yeah, what is he waiting for? <laughs> or maybe he's being cautious. Staying keeping his distance for now and, and waiting for some, the right decision. Yeah, there's archers there. Don't forget, guys. Hmm. It's better to like stay out of his way because you, if you guys get involved, then you know you should get in, in his way of his battle. So better may as well let him be the one man army. Hmm. Not yet, of course. Not yet. Hmm. So they can jump over if they want to. Oof. Hmm. He can handle it, but obviously, want to avoid conflict with the other his own team members and his son. So he's trying to think of an alternative way. 
which is to mm. okay by the name of Odin I challenge you to a one-to-one -one battle oh very noble thing to do I guess of course it has to have to end the fight peacefully you need to you know um, go for a one-to-one -one battle with the, the captain or boss in the name of Odin too so it's gonna be a big one what you can tell he's the captain from the smell does he smell differently from everyone else maybe I guess okay so he challenged him to a fight See, it's close enough for him to jump over. <laughs> oh, 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 one to one, guys, one to one. So you either everyone dies or let the boss dies. That's the option. So they do the noble thing. Okay. Oh, so he knows him. Because of course, Floki. Yes. I mean, he is the one that hires him, so yeah. Dude. Dude. Dude, that kid, man. Stay out of it. Unless you want to get involved with it. I mean, he's been passionate that his father's strong, but dude, stay calm. Let your father do the fighting. Don't get mixed up into it. <sighs> Here we go. Oh, walking close. Hmm. What is he gonna do now? Oh! Oh, is he using this as a distraction? Knew it. Camouflaging it. <sighs> Ooh. Ouch! Wow, I managed to graze them only. Wow, he dodged it in time. Whew. Wow, he even dodged the kick too. Wow, this guy means business. Hmm. Hmm, not gonna work now because he's aware of his fighting style now. Oh. Oh. He's taking precautionary stuff now because he knows that Thor is gonna mean, gonna mean business. This 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 is trigger him. Oh, he's bringing his A game. He's bringing in his A game. Ooh! Wow! Wow! Ooh! Wow. <laughs> wow. He means business now. <laughs> Ooh, wow. Oh my god. Yep. He's pushing him back, man. Or he's waiting for the right moment to strike his door. He's just waiting for an open. Op an opening. Oh, destroying his sword. Oh yeah, his sword too. No way! He just used his armor. Oh wait, what? Oh, 
Oh, he lo he's waiting for him to let, let his guard down so he can strike his hand. Wow, that's smart thinking. Guess Thor is quite uh, a strategic, it's quite a strategic, and he, yeah, he played to his script, man. Played to his script. <sighs> My God, Thor means business. He's amazing, man. What? Surrender. <laughs> Yeah, if I were Thor, I would finish him off because if you don't kill someone off like that is very scheming like him, he's gonna try something stupid to wait to you know get what he wants. I have a bad feeling about this, dude. Thor, finish him off. I have a very bad feeling about this. If Thor don't go for the kill or the finishing blow. And he's awake too, so he could get mixed up into it. Yeah, I know, right? He lost. Hmm. Honor the rules, honor the Odin. Oh my god, trying to buy time, isn't he? By measuring his past and his, why he retreat. Okay, you're imperfect. Really? A real warrior doesn't need a sword? What's that supposed to mean? Fight barehanded? What is that supposed to mean? What? Did you just say? Lead is banned? Are you kidding me? That's a joke man. Why would Thor do that? Oh dear. See what I mean? See what I mean? This is why you should go for the kill. Do you really think that should back honor the god? <sighs> okay. <sighs> Come on, just go for the kill, man. Jesus Christ, man. Yeah, he win fair and square. Leave the fight. What? Are you going to give up his life like that? What? Are you telling me he's... Wait, are you telling me he is actually going to give up his life just to spare his son?
Dude, now this is such a cowardly act. He won fair and square, and now he, he just. Oh, you barely draw him, man. Okay, at least he's a goat. At least he's not that of a sunken idiot. I mean, a shitbag. Well, yeah, I guess honor his head to the uh, the guy so that he won't attack this village. Just let go of him. Dude, this bastard. Dude, you really think you can defeat him? See? He just... Really, man? So he, his life worth more than them. Well, makes sense. Spare, sparing the rest of them, I guess. See, this is what I mean. Go for the kill. Well, if you just kill, if you kill like um, as as read that idiot, the arrow will shoot anyways. But you know, kill off the boss. Okay, I knew it. This is the start of Dorfin becoming very angry, depressed because he want to avenge his father's death. A very cowardly way of, the, of you know, killing off Thor. Oh, look. See, he spare your men and you killed him off. What a stupid coward. Can't even accept defeat. Well he just spare his men and retreat, but still. Oh look at that face man. Now that's the face I want to see. Oh, you guys would, you know, one day meet your end if he comes after your life. I know they're shocked. For yeah, I know. From he's a kid and he has that face already. He means business.
<laughs> of course. I mean, grow strong, kid. One day you you will avenge his death. Not in this age, right now. I feel sorry for the kid, man. I really feel sorry for him. He had to witness his father die right in front of his eyes in a very cowardly way by that fucking ass. Re ass I just call him a bastard from now on. Dude, he, you lose. Leave. Fair and square. And you're gonna play dirty to get what you want? Well, I, I sort of saw it coming anyway, knowing knowing his personality and stuff like that. <sighs> this is like one of the, the I don't want to be honest, not the worst death ever, but some it's like the most unhonorable way of dying. He should die in an honorable fight. I mean, if Thor lose, I accept that he he would die, but. He won, but he he died. Dude, I just hope Dwarfin can you know sort of slit his head. Seriously, man. I just want to see Dwarfin get his revenge. That would be a very pleasant sight to see. But, yeah. Oh my god, what what can I say about this episode? I mean, at first we saw that Thor can sing, send like, you know, defeat everyone with his hand without using sword. He didn't even kill anyone. So he has no right to, you know, sort of like die in the, in the, in the, in the stead, but... <sighs> Dude, you swore to Odin that you fight a fair square fight, but in the end, you have your own sort of ugly tactics to get what you want. So you decide to let I I, I I don't think he actually saw it coming that one of his I think one that berserker guy jumped to the point and using his Thor Thor son Thorfinn as a like a um you know victim uh, what's the term oh my god I can't even think properly um as a hostage yeah as a hostage using him as a hostage I don't think he saw it but I think he's just reading the mood and using it as an opportunity to bargain with Thor. <laughs> But seriously, man, he should have just say, "Hey, stand down, go back to the boat. I lost, a f lost a fight fair and square, so we are retreating." But no, he decided to use this as an opportunity to kill Thor by forcing him to drop his sword. Because he's, he say, because I mean, he is he is taking orders from Floki and stuff like that. But at least honor the fighting rule. Oh, well, at least he retreat, of course, not killing any. Of Hopefully he didn't kill any of those men that was, you know, told, told him to like not to harm them and retreat. But not sure about that. But still, I think he spared them. Hopefully he spared them. But still, the way he, he the way he just cowardly, you know, decide to um, do get what he wants by killing Thor. Seriously, just. I mean, if if Thor just kill him. The arrows still fire at him. I, I'm pretty sure Thor can dodge the arrows, knowing how how he fought up everyone with his bare hand. So if those arrows will not, you know, like you know, scare him at all. He just like oh arrow, like grab onto those arrows. But he just purposely let those arrows hit him. So yeah, I mean, I'm pretty sure Thor can dodge those arrows, but I, he let the arrows fire at him so that he can so that his son can be spared. Really, man? I thought I know the door will die, will trigger his son to become this anger depressed, which I sort of see. We can already see that in the end of the episode that he's just done go insane, trying to have a life goal now. He has a life goal, and the only goal in his life kill Asrid or, or that bastard. So, yeah, I don't even want to pronounce his name correct because I really hate him already. 
but yeah, I just hope Thorfinn can sort of slit his throat to avenge his father's death. And yeah, I think this is like the beginning of seeing Thorfinn as no longer this cheerful, cheerful uh, little kid anymore, but more of this angered, revengeful person. So I'm hoping he can get stronger and able to develop his skills or becoming more like his father so that he can one day defeat um, Asri, Asred, oh fucking hell, I just call him Bastard from now on. Um, so yeah, I mean, I, I would say the, the fight between Thor, Thor and Asri, uh, that, bast that bastard, um, let's just say it was quite a, um, a skillful, uh, more like a strategic fight. Thor, so you know, so so for so, so, so like plan ahead, and he and he sort of like let him lose lose his uh, loses his guard by thinking that he have the upper hand, and just like smash his hand and and Thor just grab on his sword and pin him down, dude. That is just that's straight up victory for him, man. That's straight up victory, dude. That was some smart thinking, Thor. Not only he's good at fighting, he's also smart and able to have a very strong, a very straightforward strategy in his mind. So you can say he was. I expect nothing less from the troll of somewhere. So he's. Why do think he's a, one of the most recognized commander, which he sort of abandoned his mission 15 years ago and start a family, live peacefully. So I think Floki is having none of it. So you just want him dead so that he can sort of have his grudge removed. But so that was one insane fight. I mean, he can. I, I can tell you this. If Thor go serious or go back to his old self all those vikings all those pirates will die already but Thor decides to stick to his current self and just like you know injure them very badly so they weren't able to fight or stand up dude I, I'm pretty sure Thor can easily s destroy all everyone well I'm not sure about archers but he'll find a way of course but just the fact that he challenged to challenge uh, 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 that bastard to a one-to-one -one fight in the in the in the eyes of Odin, in the eyes of the god of a fight of the gods, uh, well, fight, to, uh, or you know something, um, to you know just like you know surrender, f go for the people, go for the bid for other person, but the f uh, but I, in the end he spared them, but with a cost, of course. There, be, there should be no cost in this fight, man. There should be no cost in this fight, but... I mean, it's sad to see Thor gone now, and now we have focused the story on Thorfinn. So, how will this story progress? This? Not sure, maybe we're gonna see Thorfinn sort of go through this training arc or something, or maybe go through this, you know, survival stage where he finds ways to get strong, and sort of find for some reason he tags along with that guy that killed his father, but I'm pretty sure next episode we're gonna see how Thorfinn goes about to, like, improve his skill, improve his, you know, strength, improve his desire to get his revenge. And maybe we get to see some sort of strong anger or strong more of war coming our way too because they have to, they have to go to England to fight off the English. So I can see some um, very strong fight, uh, strong fight scenes coming our way too. So I just can't wait to check out next episode already. But for now, this fight is just so, I'm just infuriated, man, infuriated. I just wish. I just really wish they could have just, and I just, I wish, I, to be honest, if I, if I were to re-script this, I want Thor to die in the one-to-one -one fight, but instead, uh, that, that will, our honor, of course, I'll, I'll respect that, that way of dying, but I do not respect this way of dying. I do not respect this way of dying. I hate it. So, yeah. That's my review for today's episode, and hope you guys enjoyed my reaction today. Give a like if you enjoyed my reaction. Subscribe and try for reaction review content. And I'll see you guys in my next reaction video, which will be Ariferetta coming out soon. Jane.